What's up, everybody? JJ here, and I am at a hardware store, which is open during the shutdown because it is essential services. But I have gotten a few questions about um, a suspension trainer and what are some of the options. And so, what I wanted to show you guys, um, if you wanted to mount something to your ceiling, the uh, the thing that I recommend you get, we're actually in kind of the the straps and sort of automotive section where you can find this in a lot of places, is one of these real heavy duty surface mount D-rings. So this is rated for, for 3,600 pounds. Um, and you'll notice it only has two anchor points. And you'll want to get um, some, some four inch lag bolts and mount that into the you know a two by four ceiling. So you can even go through the sheetrock and that's going to be pretty stable. If you get two of those, one for each, each ring or each each suspension trainer strap, um, you're going to be plenty. You don't even have to go that that big and heavy duty, but I would not recommend the smaller ones. These are these are only if, like you know it says it says 400 pounds. I mean you could do that, but uh, mainly if you're just doing ring rows, ring push-ups, that would be fine. But I wouldn't recommend it if you're going to be doing ring dips or muscle ups or whatever. And you can see that they're about you know six, eight bucks, something like that. Now from a strapping standpoint, there's all kinds of strap options here, um, but probably the best one is this um, these are standard cam buckle tie downs right and these will run you about about uh you know 16 17 bucks um you can see that there um they are going to be a little bit narrow and they they may slip a little bit so you may have to tie but each one of those straps is 10 feet so um if you do a single strap and then and then make your little, little handle you know you can have up to 10 feet you can double them up and then you can have a 10 foot loop um, so it should be plenty for most people. Um, but if you can get one that's a little bit wider, those are those are about an inch wide. Um, going a little bit wider will be better. So you could try to get something more um, something more like this, where you have ratcheting systems. Um, but that might be kind of awkward to kind of deal with. I think the the, um, the cam buckles are ones that can slide and adjust really easily. So that's why I recommend those. But uh, Maybe in one of these future videos, I'll show you guys how to how to make one of these and mount it and everything. But uh, if you have more questions, don't forget to leave them in the comments. And uh, don't forget to like this video and subscribe. Thanks a lot and thrive on.